Uh, Mark, brilliant win by your boy there tonight from a draw that really suits him. Yeah, it does suit him. Uh, a lot of the experts rate him off in the eight box, but uh, we saw him on second to Shimmershine at Horsham in near track record time not that long ago, and uh, that was off the eight. And he won off the seven at Ballarat just before he came up here. So uh, it's a good box to stay out of trouble. Yeah, absolutely. He tends to appreciate that. Just a little bit extra room to move early, doesn't he? Yeah, well, last week, his first run here, he just got squeezed up at the start and it was a, just a forget run. But, uh, you know, we know how good he is. So, um, no, it was a sensational performance. Yeah. And I know, look, he only just come back from Victoria, but it would have been a bit of a no-brainer to bring him here. You know he loves the big tracks. Yeah, well, he'd done his early racing and his early education here. Well, he'd run 22-20 over the 400 uh, as a pup, you know, as a 17-month-old pup. So, um, yeah, this was the obvious choice of track for us. Where as soon as the race came on, we said, well, we're going to Maitland with him. Yeah, and just between you and me, Mark, no one else needs to know, $9 went up. Yeah, pretty handy. As we said, if the race was in Victoria, it would have been $2.40. It's nice of the, tab. It's nice of the uh, race sponsors to put up such generous odds for you. Yeah, yeah, I don't know why they didn't give us a chance, but uh, I'm sure they won't be betting $9 next week. So.